So, in this session, we are going to see algebra, some more problems. First one is, a bus covers a distance of 90 km at a uniform speed. So, uniform speed means, gradually it goes in 90 km speed. Okay. Uniform means equally. So, it covers a distance 90 km. Speed is not given. Okay. Then, had the speed been 15 km per hour, more if the, if the speed is 15 km per hour more it would have taken 30 minutes less for the journey remember this word had the speed increased 15 km per hour more means increased it would have taken so if it is increased what will happen 30 minutes less for the journey find the original speed of the bus so, what we have to find? Original speed. See, distance is given here. First, what is given we have to write. Here, distance is given. Distance to cover. Here, it is given. Distance is 90 km. And, here it is given... Speed is not given, so we are taking let speed equal to x just x we are taking x kilometer per hour. Okay, now time what's the formula for time? Time is we know the formula you would have studied in science, it is distance by speed, distance by speed. We know distance is 90, speed is x. So, what you are getting? Time taken to cover 90 km is 90 by x. Okay, this is one equation we finished. Now, what they are saying is, if it is increased 15 km more, the, had the speed been 15 km more, it would have taken 30 minutes less. That means what they are saying is, if it increased 50 km, speed is 15 km per hour increased. So, this is a first point given. If this is increased, then your equation will be, they are saying, it is 30 less, 30 minutes less they are saying. 30 minutes less mean 30 by 60, one hour 60, no. So, that means 30 minutes means, you know, half an hour. We have to convert to hours, it is half an hour. So, the meaning for this is, had the speed been 15 km per hour more, it, if it is more, 15 km per hour more, it would have been taken 30 minutes less. So, that means, we are saying, this 90 minus x, 90 by when it is increased to 15 minutes, then it would have taken half an hour. This is the equation for that. This is the meaning for that. When it is 15 km per hour, when it is increased more, this one. So, half an hour it is, it would have taken half an hour less. The result will be half an hour less. That means, actually, here 90 by x minus 90 by it is increased, so half an hour less it is. Okay. So, now... We have to simplify this. We know LCM, we can take both. Now cross multiply. So now, now you can multiply with bracket. 90, you have to multiply with this. What you are getting? 90x. Plus 90 into 15. 0 will leave it. We can put later. 9 plus 45, 4. So what you are getting? 1, 9. 9 ones are 9. 4 remainder. So you are getting 1, 3, 5, 0. That 0 put it. So you are getting 1, 3, 5, 0. 90 minus 90x as it is by x into x plus 15 equal to half now. Now plus 90x minus 90x getting cancelled. 
So now we are having the equation 1350 by x into x plus 15 is equal to half. Now again cross multiply. So 1350 into 2 equal to 1 into 1 into anything you will get the same answer. Now multiply 200 zero zero for the certain one remainder 7. So we are getting 2700 zero zero x into x x square plus 15x multiply with this. Now we are going to take this side because we are going to this is a quadratic quadratic equation we are getting. So you have to solve using quadratic formula because factorizing it's not possible here. So you have to use quadratic equation formula. In another video, I explain how to use this. So, you are getting the equation x square plus 15x minus 2500. Now, we have to solve this x by using quadratic formula because i s power is 2. Either factorization or quadratic formula, any one you can use it. So, a is quotient of x squared is a, that is 1, b equal to 15. And c equal to minus 2700. What is quadratic formula? Minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac by 2a. So minus 15 plus or minus square root of 15 square minus 4 into a is 1 c is minus 2700 we are just substituting for a b c by 2 into a minus 15 plus or minus 15 squared 15 into 15 we know 225 minus and minus plus 2700 into 4 0 0 28 2 remainder 4 to 8 10 so we are getting 10800 by 2 so minus 15 plus or minus add this 225 5 2 10 5 1 1 so you are getting 11,025 by 2 now we have to find the square root for this remember you can take 1 1 1 is a 1 subtract it 0 so bring 10 down and you can multiply here by 2 right here but 10 is lesser number any number you multiply it will go above so you have to bring it down so bring it down put 1 0 here 1 0 here and bring this down if you multiply with 20 here and here any number you have to get 10025 you know last number is 5 means you can use only 5 if you multiply correctly you are getting that is 10,025. So you are getting 105 is the square root for 11,025. So you are getting minus 15. Square root is removed now because we got for the square root 105. Now you have minus 1 value plus 1 value. So plus 105 you take 1 value. Minus 15 minus 105 take 1 value. So when you subtract this 105 minus 15 you are getting 90 by 2. This one when you add it you are getting 120 by 2. When you cancel it you are getting 45 here minus 60. Minus value inadmissible. So take only positive value. So original speed of the bus is. If I don't write, you people not writing, always I am telling children, you have to write the answer. Take it out and write the answer. I will tell orally, but you are all going to face the public exam. You have to write the answer correctly. So, the answer is original speed of the bus is 45. Children, so this is your sum. And your bus is 90 km speed. Uh, 90 km distance with the uniform speed it's going and had the speed when it is increased 15 km per hour more it would have taken 30 minutes less so that only this meaning 30 minutes less that means 30 minutes means half an hour so you are getting the equation first equation is 90 by x x is the speed 90 km next when it is increased by 15 the distance between I mean the subtracted because it is less so this actually will come this side so we can take this right away this equation so 
otherwise you have to take 90 by x minus half equal to 90 by x plus 15 from that only we are getting this so after that you are multiplying taking LCM cross multiplying the main bracket and using quadratic formula you are getting so using quadratic equation only you can solve not by factorization method take a b c as you should find the square root and you are solving but minus answer in inadmissible we cannot take it so take plus answer so original speed of the bus you have to write last step test 45 so i hope you understand this one